The odds are well and truly stacked against the Brumbies. 25,000 kilometres of travel, a hectic schedule, but amongst all the madness, there's a remarkable sense of calm. Yeah, I think, you know, it's important that we do. You know, I think it's, uh, it's a case of ticking all the boxes you know, from a preparation perspective and not being too distracted by, you know, all the other responsibilities around media and you know, people after tickets and all the kinds of things that come around with the excitement of this week. But, you know, I think it's, it's important for us to recognise that, you know, these weeks and, and these games don't come along very often. We should enjoy it and, and we should prepare hard. We won't train too much. You know, we've got to just freshen ourselves up, so just enjoy the hype and you know, enjoy you know, a really exciting time in our careers. The Brumbies, the longer the game went on, just they started to really believe. It was one of their greatest victories. A win on the high felt against a hostile Bulls. Now, history needs to be made twice in a fortnight. Uh, plenty, mate. We'll put it all in. It's the last game of the year for us and, uh, yeah, we'll put it all on the line. Um, a lot of it's been about our preparation and, and worrying about our game. We've got plenty of improvement there and hopefully we can put a complete performance out on uh, Saturday night. Yeah, we've been looking at them since the, the flight over, so uh, we just sort of had computers uh, floating around the plane and everyone sort of started to do their homework then. So we know obviously how big a game this is for, for Australian rugby and also the franchise. Um, so uh, everyone will be doing their homework uh, properly and, and individual and as a team. Both Henry Spate and Christian Lealiafano have spent time in Waikato colours during the ITM Cup and the squad is leaning on them for advice. Oh, they just they just said they're a very, very big physical team. They, they, they like to be physical and, and try and bully you, I guess. Um, uh, they also have a couple of friends there in the, in, in the back line and, and stuff like that. So it's always good having uh, an inside word and, and how players play. But at the end of the day, I think you've got to do your own review and, and see how you uh, pick out players and, and how, how you think they're going to play and what they do. So. The Brumbies are aware of the Chiefs' threats. They're all over the park. But there's one thing they're most wary of. Look across the board, I think the biggest threat is probably their self-belief. You know, they've been in the final and they've won. They've been in this situation last year. Uh, and, you know, I think that's, 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 that's important and it can support a lot in finals.